this is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video, and another video inside of Stampy's uh, lovely world. Good morning, William Beaver, and good morning, Squishy. Uh, Squishy, you used to always come and say good morning to me now, now you're running to, to William Beaver. <laughs> Actually, you haven't met William Beaver before. Uh, I'm going to go down and introduce you properly, but you can uh, get to, to know each other a little bit now. Well, I, of course, go inside and have my breakfast and say good morning to you, Barnaby. I have so many animals all around my world now. i got chickens and ducks and beavers and dogs and all sorts. <laughs> and, of course, I am a cat. Right then, let's go and uh, have my breakfast. I had uh, had another attempt uh, doing the, the secret recipe, so uh, let's uh, give it a taste and a uh, See how it is. Yeah, it's it's salty. Yeah, it's a it's a salty cake, and sometimes a bit of salt's okay. I mean, I rather sugar, but yeah, that was a little bit too salty. I'm all thirsty now. Yeah, that wasn't the the best cake, and I know cake is cake, and I love cake, but yeah, maybe not that one. <laughs> right then, let's go now and uh, head to the uh, the love garden, and uh, yeah, I can go and uh, announce uh, who it is that has been added to it today. And in fact, I am not adding a person to the the love garden today. I am adding two people to the the love garden today. Uh, today, I am adding a. Uh, and Gideon and that's because they sent me this picture of them dressed up as Ballistic Squid and me and this is at Salt Lake Comic Con and there's some homemade costumes uh, of, uh, of me and Squid and I thought they're so amazing and you can see us uh, with uh, a squid girl from Splatoon as well. <laughs> I wanted to say the uh, the costumes are so amazing. Uh, thank you for, for making them and sending me the, the picture and welcome to my love garden. Uh, right then, uh, let's go and see how Squashy and, uh, and uh, Billy Beaver are doing. Oh, it looks like they're, they're having fun together. They both love uh, playing around in the, uh, the water. Uh, right then, are you guys ready to go and play a brand new mini game? I'd want to go and uh, and have some fun. Uh, so this is a, a game to decide who's going to be the employee of the the month at the uh, the new vet which I've built recently. So let's go and uh, head over. Uh, before we go there, I am going to go and oh, there's a pig in a tree over there. <laughs> yeah, before I go over there, I'm going to go and drop off Barnaby uh, at the uh, the dog house so he can go and spend the the day there. Uh, but I'm not. Uh, picking up uh, another dog because I have a dog already at the the game and that is because uh, that dog is going to be helping us play and I'm going to explain more when I get there. Oh, hello Squashy. <laughs> Still trying to, to fly I see. Not successful yet but one day. Alright then let's go and uh, uh, head inside of here and uh, Barnaby can go and, uh, and sit down. You can go and sit down there and actually you can have a drink of water and I might do the same because <laughs> I still got horrible salt in my mouth and uh, that tastes like dogs. <laughs> I haven't had very many tasty things today. Let's uh, let's eat some bread. Um, um well, it wasn't tasty, it was a bit bland, but it didn't taste bad, and I guess that's uh, <laughs> that's what I'm going to have to, to settle with uh, for now. Alright then, uh, let's go and head to the, the game. So it's going to be called uh, the Poorly Pets Game, uh, which is of course named after the, the vet itself. And uh, the reason it's called that is because uh, there are some poorly pets. And the, the aim of the game is that uh, you need to go and give all of the, the pets the uh, the medicine that they need uh, in order to, to make them feel better. And uh, th there's uh, pretty much uh, every animal that's in my world, uh, there are a few that I don't have, I think, like, squid and things and mooshroom aren't here. But apart from that, uh, we have ourselves a poorly cow, a poorly sheep, a poorly chicken, a poorly pig, <laughs> a, uh, a poorly dog, and uh, mittens. And the, the dog is, uh, if you're going to turn around, um, excuse me, excuse me, uh, excuse me, hello. This is, of course, Corey, uh, who was with me in the, the last episode as well. So uh, he seemed to enjoy the, the vet so much, I thought I'd bring him along now. So they're not actually poorly. They're actually all quite happy. But uh, we're pretending they're poorly, and we need to give them the, uh, the things that make them happy. The difficult thing is we need to do it all while riding on the back of a pig. As you can see uh, inside of here, and oh, this ground shouldn't be like that. Let's try and let's stomp on the ground a bit. There we go. <laughs> yeah, what we need to do is uh, we need to go and get the, the bone mill to do seeds to get wheat. Uh, there's a pork chop here, uh, which we need to cook in a furnace, which is down there. Uh, we need to catch a fish uh, with a fishing rod inside of this chest here. And then over here is just a, a hoe. And then the last thing is a carrot, which is all the way at the, the top up there, uh, which we need uh, to feed to the, the pig. So we basically need to get uh, all of the, the things that makes the uh, the animals happy and uh, give it to them uh, so they're all happy at the same time so you know when they're happy all of the, the love hearts come out uh, they need to all be uh, doing that at the the exact same time and whoever uh, can do that quickest is going to win the game and be the employee of the the month at the uh, the vet so uh, let's go over here and to uh, see who's going to, to go first so uh, William Beaver uh, do you want to, to go first uh, make sure do you have a, a carrot on a on a stick I got a, a few here if you if you don't there you go oh, he had one anyway and no eating the carrots off the sticks either they're for the game only <laughs> right then so whenever you're ready uh, you can go and hop on the, the pig I'll say three two one uh, and then you can uh, begin the time will start and uh, yeah all you need to do is get all of the the animals happy uh, as fast as you can so you can begin in three two one and go right his 
time has started and he has started. So it uh, looks like the, the first thing he's gone for is the, the hoe. Uh, he basically needs to, to kind of gather all of the, the materials, uh, but he can do it in whatever order he wants. He could try and catch the fish first. He could cook the pork chop first. He could grow the wheat first. He can do it in whatever order he wants, uh, but I don't know uh, what the uh, the fastest route uh, is going to, to be. It seems like he's decided to go to all of the, the chests first and to just try and get all of the, the materials to, to begin with. And now he's going for a little bit of a, a swim in the, the water. <laughs> <laughs> don't blame the pig. Don't get angry. <laughs> You're the one controlling it. Oh, there he goes. He's now gone down the, the hole and he's now cooking the, the pork chop uh, in the, the furnace. So that's going to be for you, Corey. You're going to be a very full up dog at the, the end of the day with all of the, the pork chops you're going to be given. <laughs> and uh, now where is he heading to? We've got stuck under the, the carrot for a bit there. Oh, he's trying to, to grow the, the wheat now. Uh, but of course... He needs to get the, the seeds first, and I haven't given him any seeds. The only way he's going to get the, the seeds uh, is by breaking tall grass. And uh, because he's got bone meal, uh, he can place the uh, the bone meal on the, the ground and then destroy it. And if he gets lucky, uh, he'll get some seeds, because he actually uh, needs three seeds. He needs uh, two seed uh, to, to grow the, the wheat and uh, one seed uh, to give to the uh, the poorly chicken uh, down here as well. So he basically just needs to, to go around the place and uh, destroy it. Uh, something that would normally be uh, a pretty easy task to do, but but when you're riding on the, the back of the pig, uh, things aren't so easy. And oh, I think I think he got a few seeds there. There's another one right in front of him. Uh, he's going to have to get out his uh, carrot if he wants to go and head in that direction uh, to try and pick it up. But he's at least got a, a few, at least two, maybe uh, three. So he can at least start uh, growing his wheat. And don't worry, uh, we don't have to, to sit here waiting for the, the wheat to grow. Uh, because of course he's got his bone meal. Uh, he can pretty much make it grow instantly. And that will make the animals uh, happy. And oh, he's planted all of the, the seeds. He only needs two pieces of wheat. Uh, but he's decided uh, to plant them all. Uh, uh, hopefully he hasn't done all of them because he needs some spare seeds uh, to give the to the chicken but I guess uh, you do get some seeds back when you break away the, the wheat anyway so he's definitely got the, the wheat and I know he's cooking the pork chop I don't know if he's got it yet uh, but I know he doesn't uh, have the um the um uh, the carrot uh, from the, the top of the, the carrot there. And uh, <laughs> I think he's having a little bit of trouble getting out of the, the water there. Uh, the reason there's a, a stream uh, is to make it so you don't get stuck in the, the water and you can get pushed out. And oh, actually, uh, something else he doesn't have uh, is the, the fish either. He hasn't gone fishing yet. And whoa, the chicken is going really fast. It's very difficult uh, to go up and get the, the carrot uh, when the uh, the pig uh, is running around quite that fast. It looks like uh, for now, though, uh, he's going to, to do some fishing. So uh, even though uh, the, uh, the water is really shallow... Uh, uh, there are actually fish in there. You can actually still get fish. Uh, but the difficult things with fish is that sometimes uh, you can catch them almost immediately. And uh, sometimes uh, you're waiting for a very long time. So I think that uh, this is uh, one of the, the things uh, that is going to be most different uh, from all three of us. Uh, sometimes uh, you might get it really quick and sometimes it's slow. And it's a little bit out of your control, but a little bit not. Because, you know, if you're too slow to, to react and you miss the fish then that's your fault. But if you're kind of waiting there for ages and you just don't get any fish, uh, then that's kind of just the game's fault and there's uh, not much uh, you can do about it. But I believe, uh, if I've been watching correctly, uh, the only things he needs to do is uh, possibly to, to get the uh, the cooked pork chop uh, from down uh, in the, the furnace uh, and uh, the carrot as well. And then, of course, the uh, the fish, uh, which he's uh, trying to, to get right now. Uh, luckily, uh, his pig uh, does seem to be behaving. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, William. I didn't mean to say that. <laughs> I had to jinx it. As soon as I said uh, that his pig is behaving and uh, standing still, it decided uh, to go for the for a wander. Sometimes the uh, the pigs uh, can go a little bit crazy and uh, you can't really see uh, the, the fishing line very well, uh, which makes it uh, a lot harder. But... Uh, yeah, it looks like his, his pig is generally cooperating. <laughs> it is hiding a little bit be, uh, behind the uh, the chest here. Uh, but generally, uh, his pig is being uh, being okay. Uh, I'm not sure if he's um if his fishing line's too close to the, the ground, actually. I don't know uh, whether he needs to do the, the fishing line a little bit closer in the, the water. Uh, even though it does look really shallow, uh, it, you are able to, to get fish in it. I did have a, a test uh, before we started. Oh, there we go! He got his fish! He got his fish! That is good. It did take a lot of time, uh, but we have no idea uh, how long it's going to take when me and Squashy go as well. So now it looks like he's tackling the difficult carrot challenge where he needs to guide uh, the pig up to the, the top and uh, inside of the, the chest is a, a carrot and he needs to, to try and grab it. And look, the pig is going very slow and careful. That makes it a lot easier and he's looking in the, the chest. Uh, he needs to get the, the carrot out and then he needs to try and make his way back down. And oh, careful there! <laughs> he used his fishing rod and knocked the, uh, the pig down. Right, does he have everything? I don't know if he's got the, uh, the pork chop yet. There's a chance 
Uh, he doesn't have the, the pork chop, so he might have to, to go down and uh, and try and get that first. And it looks like uh, that is exactly uh, what he uh, is doing. And now he's riding back out. And I believe, if I'm correct, he should now have uh, everything that he that he needs. And uh, all he needs to do is uh, head over here and uh, start feeding uh, all of the, the animals, uh, all of the, the things to, to make them happy. Come on, come on, come on, William. You've got to be as fast as you can. Whoa, there we go. Now the pig had a burst of speed. <laughs> right, he's doing it. He's uh, making them them all better. So uh, you need to give the, the fish to Mittens. Uh, Mittens will do does not want to eat any seeds. <laughs> the uh, the pork chop uh, to to Corey down there. Oh no, he didn't eat it. He's got he's got to eat it. There we go. You're fed it to him now. And then of course the uh, the pig uh, wants to eat some of the uh, the the tasty carrots. And it's quite difficult because you've got to keep getting the uh, the uh, the the stick with the the carrot on. Nope, sorry, the the carrot with a stick on. Oh no, I did say it right. <laughs> yeah, you need to keep getting it back out in order to to move along. And then the uh, all of the other animals get their food. And then no, the the chicken, the chicken William, the chicken still needs the the seeds. There's still one more thing. Oh no, he's moved away. I think he thought he won. Oh, no, no, he's fallen down the hole. This is really bad. I think he thought he did it. I think he was celebrating, but he hasn't given the um, he hasn't given the the chicken uh, any of the uh, the seeds yet though. Uh, you gotta come over here and uh, try and give the uh, the chicken the seeds. Oh, did did he give the chicken the seeds? Well, am I wrong? Oh, I guess he did then. I guess I just uh, I didn't see uh, the the hearts coming out then. Uh, right then. That's, uh, that's time then, so I'm not sure the exact point he did it, but let's say it was about six minutes. I think uh, the time that I had for, for now uh, was about six and a, a half minutes, uh, so let's say uh, six minutes uh, on the, the time uh, for, for William Beaver. Not a bad time uh, whatsoever. So we're right, 6M, uh, just for, for six minutes, and uh, a very good time uh, for the, the first person uh, going up. It's very difficult uh, to, to go first, and what I might do is uh, go and uh, give some, some carrots uh, to our pig here as well, because everyone else got some, uh, some food, <laughs> but this big here uh, did not get any right then uh, let's all uh, go to, to sleep and then in the, the morning uh, I'm going to, to have my go so uh, William Beaver if you want to head over here we'll have a, a quick nap and then in the morning I'm going to go and have my go on the the poorly pets game and I need to see if I can do it any quicker so the the time I need to beat is uh, is six minutes that's going to be uh, what my challenge is and that's a pretty good time especially for the uh, the first person going so uh, let me just go and uh, check uh, that all of the the game is uh, is reset uh, I need to go and uh, check inside of here oh no uh, we need uh, another another hoe uh, inside of that chest here if everyone goes and fills all of these up and uh, is the uh, is another carrot in the the top up here nope uh, we need to go and put a, a carrot up there as well let me go and uh, grab one from uh, this chest here and uh, yeah we get everything uh, ready uh, the way it needs to, to be and we can go and uh, start the the next game so there we go i've put a, a hoe in there i'm going to go and place a, a carrot in the the chest up here as well and then um, i think there should be a fishing rod in here nope uh do i have a fishing rod on me nope i do not let me go and uh, grab a, a fishing rod and i can go and put that inside of this chest here uh, i can't get them now i need to try and get them uh, while i'm on the the back of the pig we still have a uh, coal inside of the the furnace and then the the last thing i need to do is just go and stomp on the the ground a little bit <laughs> and uh, just make it uh, so that i need to, to do this myself no uh, free uh, advantages for for me and do we have another pork chop in here nope i need to go and uh, put a, a pork chop inside of uh, of that chest as well and then everything's going to be set up and uh, i can go and uh, begin the, the the next game and oh there's a spider there's a spider oh there's a spider attacking me oh no not good not good not good <laughs> i think there william beaver's trying to help me out but there we go i can go and uh, take out the the spider that is why we slept. <laughs> right then, uh, I'm ready for the. Uh, I'm ready for my game. Let's go and uh, jump on the the back of my pig. And oh, actually, one last quick check. Uh, we do have bone meal. Yep, we have bone meal as well. Right then, I'm on my pig, and uh, I need to get my uh, carrot on a stick. And I will start my time in three, a two, a one. Go, 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 go. Right, my time has started. I have opened the the gate, and uh, let's begin. So I think I'll start off by. I'll start off by doing the the wheat first. I think. I think I'm going to leave the the fish to last. That seemed to be like the the most difficult thing. So I think I'll leave that. To to last and actually while I'm here I might as well go and grab the the pork chop as well and look at this I might as well grab the the fishing rod I kind of accidentally grabbed everything and while the the pigs going crazy fast I might go and uh, oh no nope, I didn't mean to fall in the water now I'm stuck <laughs> I might go and try and go down the um uh, the little hole and try and start cooking the uh, the pork chops because the uh, the pork chops uh, take uh, a little bit of a, a while to cook uh, so I'll leave them going now and then I can come back uh, a little bit later on and uh, try and get the the rest of them and now I'm going to go and put the uh, the grass all over the the place and start breaking it away and uh, see how many seeds I can get the the pig's going crazy but it's actually kind of helping me out a little bit it's actually making it a little bit easier because in that way I can move around and grab all of the the seeds that I that I need and there we go I think I've actually I uh, got uh, enough seeds already there's two there and I think uh, Oh, no, look, there's three. There's three. Here we go. This is all of the, the seeds I need. So let's go and uh, I can plant two of them here. 
and uh, then I can go and grab the the wheat and then I can keep the oh no I didn't mean to break them I can go and put my other seeds down there there we go so I now have my two pieces of wheat and I have the uh, the seeds uh, that I need uh, as well and oh no I only got one piece of wheat there oh no look the other bit is down here in the the water if I can go and guide my little piggy wig down here there we go I have all of the the wheat and the the seeds that I need so now I think I'm gonna have a go fishing seeing as I'm down in the the water anyway I'm gonna go and have a, a go fishing and uh, see if I can catch the the fish so as I said I think this is going to be uh, where the uh, the good time uh, is either made or broken if you can catch uh, a fish quickly and oh I thought I had one then I think I was too slow I think I had a, a chance to catch one uh, almost uh, immediately but I was too slow it is a little bit difficult to go fishing while you're bobbing up and down in the water on the back of a pig <laughs> it's not the uh, the way I normally go fishing uh, but here we go oh there we go yes I was able to, to get a fish very quickly then this is good this is looking like it might be a, a very good time and now hopefully if my pig stays moving slowly I should be able to, to go up here and try and grab the uh, the carrot there we go I got the the carrot now let's try and uh, drop down like this and then the last thing I need uh, is the uh, the pork chops which should be uh, hopefully nicely cooked uh, down here in this cave let's try and uh, get the uh, down gently. oh no oh no <laughs> the uh, the carrot fell off the the stick and it turned into a, a fishing rod right let's go and uh, sorry about that pig didn't mean to <laughs> didn't mean to startle you then I kind of scared myself as well there we go I can get to the the furnace and I've now grabbed the uh, the pork chop so let's get everything I need in order so I got the uh, the wheat I got the carrot I have uh, the the fish and the pork chop right this should be everything I need let's go and uh, try and uh, heal all of my poorly pets we just go along in a row and uh, give them everything that they need. So let's go and uh, uh, try and get up the, the water first. If I try and look in this direction. Come on, piggy. Out the water. Come on, turn around. Turn around. <laughs> Pigs are not very elegant animals in the, the water, are they? All right, let's go and give the uh, the wheat to you. And then the wheat to you as well. The seeds to you. Oh, I didn't mean to, to set you free. <laughs> and then I'm going to give the uh, the carrot to, to you like that. And then the, the dog. Uh, Corey, you can have the pork chops if I try and get them to him. Stay still, pig. Stay still. Stop going back and forth. Right, mittens, you can have the the fish and then the final thing is the pork chops if I can pass it there we go in three minutes and 30 seconds three and a half minutes I was able to do it whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs> right uh, Squishy and uh, William uh, do you want to go and uh, get the the game reset uh, for Squishy's go and uh, while you guys go and do that I'm gonna go and add on my sign so there we go that was almost a uh, half of William's time I must say I am rather proud of that but I can't celebrate yet uh, because Squishy's got her go yet and uh, we have no idea uh, how well uh, she's going to, to do. So the time to beat is 3 minutes and 30 seconds and I think I did okay but there definitely is uh, room for improvement. Uh, she could uh, definitely go faster so um, yeah it's definitely not uh, the a game over yet. So I'm going to go and try and get the, the pig uh, back in the, the pen at the, the start and uh, Squishy and, uh, and William uh, if you go and just try and uh, get all of the, the chests filled up and uh, once that's done uh, we can begin uh, Squishy's go. I'm also uh, going to give some carrots. Oh, whoever's got some carrots, and um, probably you, uh, Billy Beaver. <laughs> if you give them some to our pig down here as well, because I always feel bad. All of the all of the the animals get some some food apart from our pig here, right? So uh, we have bone meal, and uh, we have the the pork chops. It looks like everything uh, is back set up uh, the way it needs to be. So uh, do you, if you have your carrots on sticks, Squishy, uh, you should be ready to to begin. Uh, there's going to be a spare one down there. Oh, that was a bad throw, wasn't it? Uh, there we go. Let me throw a, a few spares to you as well, because uh, yeah, sometimes the the pig does eat the the carrots. And uh, yeah, do you want to jump? Jump on the, the pig and I'll give you a countdown and then you can uh, begin your go. So you need to start in a three, a two, a one and go, 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 go. Right, Squishy is off. Remember uh, the time she needs to be is 3 minutes and 30 seconds. So uh, let's see uh, what strategy she goes for. It looks like uh, she's going straight uh, for trying to do the wheat as well. And I think we all went to try and do the wheat first just because it's easier. It's kind of nice just to do the, the easy thing first <laughs> and get it out of the, the way with and then start dealing with uh, trying to get the uh, the fish and the, the carrot uh, which are probably the uh, the hardest two things to, to get. And uh, are you okay, Squishy? Oh, oh, is there no fishing rod? Right, let me throw you out. Let me, I put a fishing rod inside of the, the chest. Uh, they should have uh, all been uh, filled up uh, and then uh, she's going to grab the, the pork chop uh, I do know that is uh, is definitely in there, and uh, of course the uh, the pork chop's quite difficult as well uh, because you do need uh, to try and guide the the pig uh, down that quite small tunnel, and it takes a little bit of time as well just because it has to to cook. But it looks like Squishy at the moment uh, is going crazy uh, trying to to get the the seed. So uh, this is a uh, this is a uh, quite a fun, but actually it's kind of fun just going around breaking uh, away all of the uh, uh, the uh, the grass. And oh, there we go. 
There, there is a, at least one group of seeds, maybe even two. So uh, remember, you kind of need three, uh, but you can sometimes only need two uh, because when you break away the, the wheat, you do get more seeds. But I think uh, she has uh, all of the, the three that she needs uh, already. Uh, so whenever she's ready, she can start planting that and uh, using the, the bow mill to try and grow it. Oh, no, it looks like the, the pig saying, no, go do the carrot now. Go do the carrot. <laughs> sometimes the uh, the pigs have a, a little bit of a, a life of their, their own. Just these very normal, easy tasks are just made a lot more difficult uh, just by the, the fact that you're on a pig but there we go it looks like she's uh, listened to the the pig suggestion and uh, decided uh, to jump up and uh, try and get the the carrot and she did it uh, very successfully probably quicker uh, than both me and uh, and billy did so uh, that was a uh, very impressive there and she's got her wheat and uh, the uh, the other spare seeds as well and no eating the the seeds yourself either squishy <laughs> uh, she is stuck in the the water at the moment but she's able to, to get out and uh, now she's heading down to the the pork shop so i believe she now has every single thing she needs apart from the the fish and she has about a minute and a half now to try and get the the fish and feed uh, all of the uh, the medicine to the uh, the animals uh, and then she has a, a chance of winning so it has actually uh, gone right down to the the wire this could go uh, either way it all depends on what squishy's fishing skills are like it uh, looks like she's uh, got it in okay and uh, for now uh, the pig seems to be cooperating and standing still it looks like the uh, the pig's kind of watching the uh, the fishing rod as well kind of <laughs> trying to, to help her out a little bit so there's a little bit of luck now in terms of when she gets the fish uh, but also reaction times if she's uh, too slow uh, pulling back the um the, the fishing rod uh, once it bobs down uh, then yeah she could lose out so it's uh, uh it's quite tense at the moment oh there we go it dropped down i don't think she did it i don't think she pulled it back fast enough though that was her chance if she got a fish then she could have won and she can still win she has about 30 seconds left uh, in order to, to try and win but she could have won easily then but she was slightly too slow it's not over yet though squishy and oh no oh no the pig it's getting excited. <laughs> the pig can't handle the, the tension and has gone for a, a little bit of a, a wonder. <laughs> it's pacing back and forth in front of the, the other animals. She needs to get a fish right about now if she's going to have any chance. Because remember... She doesn't just need the uh, the fish. Uh, she also needs uh, to fill, uh, f uh, feed all of the um, uh, the food to the the other poorly pets, uh, just to, to make them better again. But it seems, even though she got the the first fish very early on, the other one's not coming. Oh no! <laughs> She's fallen down the cave. I think the I think the pigs had enough. I think the pig said it's it's done and uh, has gone down. Uh, so it looks like she's not going to to beat my time, uh, but she still uh, does have a, a chance uh, to try and beat William Beaver's time. So uh, we're going to carry on the the game, even though she, uh, we know. She She's not going to be the uh, the employee of the the month. Uh, we're going to carry on the the game anyway, uh, just to see whether she's going to to be in second or third place. But this does mean that I am going to be uh, the uh, the employee of the the month. And uh, it looks like William Beaver's gone on patrol duty. Are you uh, just checking uh, in case any of the uh, the googly shot? We don't want uh, any more spiders showing up around here. It is getting dark, so that's probably uh, quite a, a good idea. And uh, it looks like Swayshi is really not uh, having any luck uh, getting any of the uh, the fish biting here. Uh, she's going to to keep going though. So uh, if it takes longer than uh, six minutes and uh, then she uh, won't be the the winner uh, but if it doesn't take that long she's going to carry on and oh uh, have you given up squishy have you have you had uh, enough fishing <laughs> i think she's uh, decided just to uh, just to, to call it a day and uh, not do uh, do any more fishing but that does mean uh, that i I'm uh, going to, to be uh, the uh, the uh, the employee of the the month though. And oh no, uh, she is carrying on. She is carrying. She is going to go and uh, carry on fishing. Oh, there we go. I dropped down. But oh no, once again, she was slightly too slow. If you just take your eyes off the uh, the fishing rod for just one second, uh, that can be all the the time it takes uh, for you able to be able to to miss it. Literally, just blinking uh, can be enough uh, for you to be able to to miss it. You just need to just stare right at it and give it 100% concentration on it, uh, just to, to make sure uh, that uh, as soon as it bobs down, uh, you're going to be ready to to pull it back and be able to, to catch the, the fish. But the time is once again going down to the, the wire. Uh, she's been doing it now uh, for 5 minutes and 27 seconds now, uh, which means that if she doesn't do it within the, the next 30 seconds, uh, then William Beaver is going to be in uh, in second place and then she uh, will be in third. So unless she gets the, the fish uh, pretty much right uh, about now, she's not going to be able to win. But it's really sad because she probably did everything else quicker than us, but the most difficult thing uh, at the end was just the uh, the fishing. And I did say uh, that is probably the, the hardest part of the, the challenge, and I think Swayshi is proving it now as her time is just about to tick over six second, uh, six minutes. And that's it. Sorry, Swayshi. Time is up. <laughs> so that means that I'm in uh, in first place. Uh, William Beaver's in second, and Swayshi, uh, sadly, in this game, uh, was in third place. So i uh, tell you what. Let's go now, and uh, let's go and uh, open out all of these fences, and let's let all of the, the animals come out uh, so they can go for a, a wander around the, uh, the world. And I need to go now. 
uh, to my vet and I need uh, to put up a sign uh, just saying uh, that I am the employee of the the month so let's go and uh, let's just put it in the the corridor here somewhere just so everyone can see it uh, when they first come in so employee or employee uh, of the month uh stampy cat there we go <laughs> i am the employee of the the month so that was it that was the uh the poorly pets game and there was uh, something else uh, that i was planning to show you today but we have uh, sadly run out of time uh, so there is something cool that i want to show you but instead i'm going to be showing you in the the next episode so make sure uh, you come back and uh, check that out and there's a chance that squishy will still be fishing <laughs> ah, dear, but that is the, the end of this episode here i want to thank you all very much for watching and i will see you all later. Bye!